Hey guys, welcome to part 21 of my Horizon Zero Dawn full blind playthrough on the PlayStation 5. We're playing on Ultra Hard Difficulty and I'm not gonna lie, these snap walls really terrify the crap out of me. Last episode we were making our way down towards uh, Meridian. However, what I wanted to do first was to get this tall neck opened up. Now, there's also a metal flower here I'd like to get. Uh, there's even that. I do want to do this, but not not today. <laughs> I'm getting, guys, I'm just excited we're in a brand new area. And it's beautiful here. It's really gorgeous. It's so nice here. It's a, it feels refreshing because we're not in Noralands anymore. Not that I don't like it in Noralands. It's pretty cool there, but... I was um, wrongfully under the impression that the entire game was just going to be just in Noraland, so that's it. Um, the world has gone a whole lot bigger, and I'm really excited about that. So anyway, so this is, I think, the Metal Flower, and here we go. All right, Metal Flower Mark Three. so let's have a look at that. Okay, Code Fragment downloaded. Okay, low in the eastern sky is set thy glancing eye. And though its gracious light never riseth to my sight. I think that's what that means. Yet every star that climbs above the gnarled limbs of yonder hill conveys thy gentle will. Guys, who's writing all this poetry? <laughs> it's awesome. I just want to know, you know, who who's leaving all this here. And guys, I want to have a fight. What the hell is that? Okay, a glint hawk. What the hell, man? Okay, flying scavengers that travel in groups. Swooping to use ranged freeze attacks or razor sharp claws. Okay, they're weak to fire. Okay, that's the body. Beak is weak to tear. Oh, and freeze sacks. So this is what causes the freeze attacks. Uh, weakness to all, apparently. Okay, it's fine, but not not today. I'm not going to fight him yet. <laughs> I want to have a fight with a snap more, if possible. I need to redeem myself. I did terrible in the last episode. I think I'm very under level for this area, but it doesn't matter. I want to give this a try. All right. All right. How do I do this? What the hell? Okay, there's one there. It's just very dodgy um, fighting here. Okay, guys, let me try and get on top of this island. And then once we kill at least one Snapmore, we're going to move on and discover Meridian. Check it out. We got handholds, guys. Excellent. Alright, where are you? Right, that's... Okay, I don't want that. Right, there we go, guys. Okay, let's set him on fire. Okay, did that work? Oh, no. I need my freeze uh, potions. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, this is what killed me last time. Shit. Shit, he's so close! Jesus! Whoa! Jesus Christ! Guys, I don't even know what to do about that. Okay. Okay. No, don't. Please, please, Aloy. Oh my god! No, I want this! Give me that. Jesus. Nope, I missed. I missed the canister. Damn it. Jeez, guys, I hate when they're so close to you. Oh, no! Stop. Just wait here. Wait here. Alright, let me try for that canister again. Shit. Guys, that was close. <laughs> he nearly killed me. Jesus. Alright, alright, it's over. 
And I think that's enough snap more fighting for now. Let's just get the hell out of it. I'm not really ready to fight these things. So, um, hopefully when we're a little bit higher level. And it doesn't help that there's no visibility as well. Jesus. All right. Okay, what I'd like to do is get back on this main road here. Oh, no, we don't have to. It's fine. We can just take um, a strider. Let me just go and grab one. Oh, no, I've got a mount. It's okay. I've got a mount. Ugh, I'll scratch that. <clears throat> All right, I need to pick up some of these medicines. All right, guys. Okay. Right, this looks like a bandit camp. We're not going to do that today, though, but um, at least I know it's there. All right, let's grab my mount. Hey, what's up, buddy? <laughs> hey, can you stop running away? Jesus. <laughs> All right. Okay, so let's go this way. Whoa, this looks... Yeah, this looks kind of dangerous, guys. Okay, anyway, let's go up this way. I hope I don't have to actually go through the bandit camp. Oh, shit, sorry. No, no, I'm just passing through. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, where to now? That's not where I want to be, man. Guys, I don't believe this. I think the only way I can get through is through the camp, right? Or maybe not. Wait, hold on. I don't believe this. Guys, I'm so pissed. Okay, let's go this way. Alright, I just need to find this road. That's all. Alright, go, go, go. Guys, really, there's a dust storm now? I really want to enjoy this new area, man. I can't see anything. God, my luck sucks. It really does. Oh, no, it's clearing up. It's okay. All right, we need to go this way. Okay, the sun machine's pissed off at me. <laughs> Let's just keep going. All right, check it out. Okay, this is a far journey, but it's okay. I'm actually enjoying this. What the heck is that? Guys, what is that? Guys, that's insane. And that does not look like a human... Uh, sorry, humans would build that. Give me a second. Wow, is this Meridian? Are we getting closer and closer? All right, campfire. Okay, excellent. Guys, are we here? Oh, wow, we're actually in Meridian. Oh, my God, look at the view, guys. All right, anyway, let's... Uh, sorry, let me snap out of this. Let's just get out of it. Let's just go to the destination. We're here, guys. We made it. We're finally in Meridian, and it's stunning here. <laughs> this is awesome, man. <laughs> this is great. Guys, I've got to say, I prefer it here than being, uh, you know, where the matriarchs are. Nora lands, basically. This is insane, man. Oh, it's not letting me move forward. Oh, that's nice. Glad I stopped for a bit. Yeah, I can't move forward, guys. Sorry. Okay, mount. Don't go anywhere. I need you. Give me a sec. Let's just quickly save it. 
All right, the city of the sun, go to Meridian. So now that we're here, I'll read out the quest. Aloy journeys to Meridian in search of Olin, the Osram scrounger she met the night before the proving. Somehow, the killers targeted her through Olin's focus, a mystery she can only solve by finding him and making him talk. All right, cool. So that's 6,000 XP and one skill point. Wow. We did it, guys. We're actually here. I'm sorry for the wait, but all goods entering the city are subject to search. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. How long do we have to wait? What am I supposed to do? Just sit here and let everything spoil? I thought Meridian was open to all, Karja. What happened to Ursa has nothing to do with us. Move along. Wait, Ursa? Isn't that the uh, general? Uh, not general, sorry. She's a captain or something? Okay, I can't remember the guy's name. Do you remember right towards the beginning of the game? Um, there was a dude with a mohawk hairstyle, Erend, Erend, right? And he had a sister called Ursa, I think. Or maybe I'm wrong, I don't know, maybe I'm misremembering. Are you guys cool with me? <laughs> okay, seems so. Olin's in there, somewhere. And so is Erend, that other outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Aaron said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the Vanguard. Guys, I'm just... My jaw's on the floor. This is visually stunning. <laughs> this is gorgeous, man. What's that? Oh, supply crate. Let's grab that. It's always the most getting through outlander guys I, I don't even know what to say this is awesome anyway let's go find errand gosh beautiful game Hold. stop right there in light of the recent attack no stranger passes into meridian without submitting to search recent attack what are you talking about the murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Carja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! Hey! I thought you were dead! Make way! Make way! All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. So, you're alive. This, uh, we should celebrate. It drinks on me. <laughs> we need to talk alone, and you need to pull it together. Over there. So hey, you boy. Approve. Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There, alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? Guys, I'm sorry to hear about his sister, man. That's terrible. Anyway, your sister? I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. And now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. Instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. Oh, okay. Uh, earlier, sorry, I was going to say, Aloy, don't be so hard on him. You know, when she said, pull it together, he just lost his sister, man. It'll get easier. I lost someone too. <laughs> Stop feeling sorry for yourself. I don't know, guys. I don't want to say that to him. Do I? Let's do that. I lost someone too because she lost Rost, you know? I, uh, I lost someone too. At the Proving, the man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. Why is it every time something terrible happens, everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, as though that makes it easier? Dude. Yeah, why is that? Anyway, 
there was something you wanted to tell me? A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. Some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived Frost. is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. Owen. I need to find Owen. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Owen is working with them. But, I mean, this... I don't need you to understand, Aaron. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents, places he returns to? A house here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess, as long as I'm there to witness the search. All right, fine. Time to go to Olin's. I need to see Olin's place. Now. Okay, okay. Come on. <laughs> this is exciting, guys. That's sad, though, about Erin's Aaron, sister. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. <laughs> yeah, I know what you guys were telling me now. You were very eager for me to get to Meridian. Yes. Wow. <laughs> anyway. Guys, this is awesome, man. Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Aaron, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. What did he mean about Ursa's murder? Not now. New music, guys. And by the way, I don't blame Aaron for feeling like this. It's pretty awful to lose a family member. Okay, how are we going to get in? Subtle. Here we are. Try not to break anything. That other than the door. All of this for one man. It pays to have connections in the Sun King's court. <laughs> this is so exciting. Yeah, I thought our whole journey was just going to be stuck in Nora Lands. It's so refreshing to be out somewhere new, you know? What's that? This rug is frayed. And the is warm. Oh, okay. Is there anything else, though, before I... All right, whatever. Let's uh, check this out. Let's see what's underneath. Hey, how did that get here? Question is, how to get through it. Without a key, you won't. That's a vault hatch of Azaram make. Nothing gets through. We'll see about that. Okay, find a way to break the hatch. I don't know. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I don't get it. Wait, wait, hold on. There's an upstairs bit. I get it. Guys, check it out. There's something we can drop onto it, I think. Guys, this is fascinating, man. What is this? That's a mural. Shut up, dude. <laughs> I'm exploring. Hold on. Isn't that that Glint Hawk thing? Anyway, whatever. Let's keep going. 
so this is Olin's house. That's a thunder jaw, guys. <laughs> that is crazy. Oh, I'm really enjoying this. This is great. Okay, there's stairs up there, but give me a second. Let's explore. Oh, I should be using my freaking focus. Give me a sec. Let's start from here. Okay. Right, family portrait, woven fabric, painted with okra and insect-derived pigments. Shows the family unit. That looks like a picture of Owen's family. Okay, I can see it now. Okay, so he had a wife. He's got a wife and kids, so... What happened to them? Alright, guys. Let's go up here. I guarantee it will be something we have to push down. Or knock knock down like this. <laughs> so, check it out. A lot of metal here. Could be just what I need. All right, prim uh, stacked ingots, primitively smelted metals, cast into blocks, considerable combined weight. Looks big and heavy. It could do a lot of damage if it fell down. Let's give it a little push. Go on, Aloy. I did say not to break anything, didn't I? <laughs> this is great. <clears throat> okay. Have a look. Now, what could be down here? Jesus. I like the music, by the way. I don't know if you guys can hear it on YouTube, but... It's really nice. Talk to Aaron. Aren't you gonna see what's down there? Well, yeah, I need to look around. Look around. <laughs> That's what we came for. <laughs> that was a bit awkward. Sorry, guys. Okay, so what's in here? Wait, something flagged up. Okay. All right, Olin's journal. Okay, we need to check that out. Um, what is this? Map. And anything else? Guys, a voice recording. Check it out. Serve and they live. Disobey and I will open their throats and leave their corpses to prune in the sun. Oh, shit. They took his wife and child captive. They? Who's they? The killers. They told him to obey or they'd kill his family. Alright, let's have a look at the journal. Looks like Olin kept a journal. Olin? I knew he could read contracts, but I never took him for a poet. No doubt now. Olin knew I was targeted. Yeah, fine, but from what I'm <laughs> gathering, it's he was forced to do it. Anyway, fourth day, I am a traitor now and see no way out. If I start at the beginning, how they turned me, perhaps I can see something I missed. No, there is no escape. What good can writing, writing it do? Tenth day, you gave me this folio when you taught me to write. All these years later, it still smells of you, a lavender and ash of the forge. All I have left of you. Write me notes, you said when you gave it. Share your thoughts, tear the leaves, send the pages. To show I'm thinking of you, but I never did. Hands too grubby to touch parchment. How I wish I'd done as you said, how I wish I could now. Fifteenth day, the same dream. Your hair in the forge light, our sun's weight on my shoulders, all of us free. You turn to me and whisper, it is a dream. I answer, yes I know. And then wake alone oh that's sad guys that sucks even awake my life is a dream a lie my treachery will not buy your freedom it only buys time but every moment you live that he lives if treachery is the cost i will pay it 34th day every week the device calls me in secret to a new dig site 
we work like men with whips to our backs. As though it was left to, to us to upturn the soil of the entire earth, and time has run low. Scrabbling to find the carcasses of ancient demons, it's the weapons they want, must be. What misery am I helping birth into this land? 38th day. I drink with Erend and Ursa, but not even the sweetest brew can wash the taste of guilt from my mouth. Every day my silence betrays them. The villains watch through the device. See, it's not his fault. Anyway, I'll tell you afterwards. I keep expecting Ursa to stick a blade through my throat. But fire and spit, she does not suspect me. A better li liar than I thought myself. Must be. 54th day. Fitful sleep the past three nights, thinking on that Nora girl. Why did it order her killed? Oh my god. The device must be. Even so, what threat could she pose? We heard explosions and distant screams from the village. I thought the savages might blame us, turn on us. I almost wish for it, but their matriarchs ordered us gone. We fled to the border with an escort of braves, crossed our day tower. Now I am called to a dig in the rock wreath. They promise another glimpse of you, of our son. How I hope to see you both. Guys, that is not his fault, man. I mean, what would you do? <laughs> Seriously, ask yourself, what would you do? So he was totally forced. Anyway. Alright, so that's the journal. What's this? And just quickly, is there anything else I may have missed? No. Alright. A map. The glyphs show places he visited. Talk to Aaron. Oh, this is this is horrible, guys. Anyway. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me in the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And these things that you see, how do you do it? I see things with a focus. I should be going. No, it's fine. I'll tell him. Why not? The focus. It reveals the unseen. And Olin's focus, it's the same? The device is the same, but somehow Olin and the killers can speak to each other with their focuses over distances and see through each other's focuses too, like looking through each other's eyes. So that's how the killers saw you, through Olin? Yes, so far as I can tell. All right, I should be going. Now that I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. All by yourself? Leave it to me. I'm faster on my own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen... Out of the way, Erend. I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. I need to know who killed Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that, but the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Why should you have justice and not me? Look, I'll head for Red Ridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Red Ridge Pass, you said. I'll see what I can do. I was going to say, um, Aloy is being a bit standoffish with him. I mean, he lets... Look, the reason we found out about Olin is because um, Aaron's helped us. So Aloy should help him. I, I want to help this guy anyway, so... Where are we? Oh, <laughs> okay. All right, find Olin at the excavation site. All right, check it out. Oh, and check it out. There's going to be a ton of side quests. So there's a lot to do again, which is great. But remember, guys, we've also got some uh, hunting grounds here. There's also a cauldron here, a bandit camp. There's another tall neck. Um, yeah, there's a lot to do still. So we're going to, you know, uh, depending on the episode, I'll decide which to do. But um, I don't mind doing this in the next one just to find out about this um, thing of Olin. Hmm.
we'll see how it goes but guys i hope you enjoyed that this is awesome being in a brand new place man i'm really excited this is great an actual city and uh yeah sucks for olin but um i hope we can talk to him you know anyway guys hope you enjoyed that thank you very much for joining me today and i'll see you in the next video take care